Max Pro is a vehicle. It is in the MRAP family. It's a mine resistant, ambush protected vehicle. Every single Max Pro in, in the world at this point has to be upgraded with new safety features, uh, new engineering change proposals to make sure that they're more survivable. We are here at Fort Bliss. SAIC's main job here at Fort Bliss is to integrate C4 ISR onto military ground platforms. Specifically would be Bradley's, uh, Abrams, which are both track vehicles, the MATV, which is a larger four-wheeled vehicle, and Humvees. We'll integrate anywhere from 200 upwards of 350 fleet vehicles. It's quite a quite a production, so the effort really is to reset these vehicles and get them into a condition such that the soldiers can use them again. Initially when I first saw the truck I was very intimidated. I thought, wow, this is a lot of things to know, a lot of things to look at. You know, working on this vehicle, this is only one of two locations in the whole United States, so I feel very, very lucky to be working on a vehicle like this. So we are currently designing our prototype vehicles, which we call gold vehicles here at Fort Bliss because the other ones will either include the same amount of systems or less. You're pushing the envelope on what was previously a good solution, but might not be viable anymore. It's a lot of puzzle pieces, a lot of different people working together. You know, it can't be all be done until we all work as one. So we'll get some feedback in a previous event, like, oh, this didn't exactly work how the soldier wanted it to. So we move things around to make sure in case you know something happens to the soldier that they're going to still be working in the battlefield. On the floor, day-to-day -day operations is, is really positive. I, I love coming to work and seeing my team, seeing how they interact and, and are just very jovial with each other. I think they're happy to be here. Because they're happy doing their job, they're going to put their very best effort into everything that they do. We do take a, a lot of pride, most of us being prior military. Every truck I build it with dedication knowing that it's going to provide protection for the soldier in the battlefield. We understand the soldier in the field and each person on my team has been affected by that understanding in some way. We have that, that relationship with our customer that really drives us forward and, and empowers us to do the very best for them. I work with great people, do a great job, have a sense of pride in what I do. I am supporting the soldier, whether directly or indirectly, and I think that's the most important thing. We are fighting